beautiful friends how are you all doing i hope you're all doing fine welcome back to my channel if you are a returning subscriber thank you so much for returning back here god bless you i really appreciate your support but if you're new here hello welcome to my channel please before you leave remember to subscribe and here subscribe click on that notification bell it is down and there so that you'll be the first one to be notified whenever i upload a new video i promise you you will always enjoy every content that i upload in this channel so dear friends in our today's video we have another girls talk <laughs> yes guys you know what tomorrow is valentine's and by the way i didn't plan to do this video but as a married woman i know already what i'm going to do tomorrow to make my valentine's day special and be the unforgettable one <laughs> so as i was thinking of my plans for tomorrow i thought of you guys you know you're always here in my heart so i thought of you ladies that have found love already and you are in a long distance relationship i've been always telling you that i am that friend and i know sometimes it is very hard to share your online dating journey your online dating secrets <laughs> with your friends that don't have any idea of how online dating world can be that is why i am here like a sister to help you to guide you give you those tips that will help you on your online dating journey and on a day like tomorrow on valentine's i am here to give you the best tips <laughs> to make your man feel happy, to make your man feel special on a Valentine's day. And you will thank me later, guys. <laughs> but we can't forget I have lots of ladies that are still searching for love. They are still single. And on a day like tomorrow, for you who uses social media, <laughs> It's the day some ladies feel like they should just go out of social media. <laughs> because you will see people sharing their romantic Valentine's dinner, their romantic getaways, sharing their gifts that they received from their boyfriends or their husbands. <laughs> oh my God, why am I so unlucky? Why am I still single till now? I want to tell you, you shouldn't worry because in this video, I'm going to be sharing with you some tips which will help you make your Valentine's special tomorrow, even if you are single. So dear friends, my tip number one will go to this category. Because when you are on online dating apps and then you find a guy, your relationship will go into stages, you know, until you get married. So my category number one I imagine you have been on online dating apps, you come across a guy and everything seems very good, you exchange WhatsApp numbers, you communicate every single day. But the stage that you are in right now, it is still only words. <laughs> this guy has not shown you the actions. You have not yet met in real life but he keeps on telling you very very sweet words words that makes you feel like he might be the one so on a day like tomorrow on valentine's what should you do because at that stage where your relationship is now it's the stage that you still have loads of questions to ask this guy it's the stage that you still need to confirm lots of things from that guy so on a day like tomorrow i want to give you this tip and it's gonna help you very very much i am very very sure call him on a surprise video call tomorrow night on a valentine's night <laughs> and see if he will pick it if he picks your call then talk to him tell him that you wanted to hear his voice you miss him so much Tell him sweet, sweet words that he doesn't suspect you were calling him to confirm if he is alone. Okay, dear ladies, <laughs> you have to play it smart. After talking to him, just stay in peace. 
but don't relax yet <laughs> i'm doing all this because on online dating apps exist lots of guys that are still married but they just want to waste your time on a day like tomorrow <laughs> you will get him all. we will get him you know in swahili they say kamata mwizi so tomorrow <laughs> We are going to Kamata Mwizi. <laughs> we will get him. If he's a cheater, then we will know he's been cheating on his wife by talking to you or on his girlfriend. So stay at peace after talking to him, but don't relax yet. Keep doing that once in a while and eventually you will stay at peace completely because I've always told you, time will tell yeah <laughs> it's just a matter of time but for tomorrow don't forget to do that <laughs> and before i forget guys don't call this guy at the time when he is sleeping <laughs> you will do it wrong that's the wrong way the time that you exactly need to call you have been communicating when he comes from work he tells you, I am back home. And some of them always updates you. Maybe I am going to shower after shower. I'm having dinner. After having his dinner, call this guy on a surprise video call. Because <laughs> if you call very, very late, he will have an excuse to tell you I was sleeping. I didn't see your call. But some of you are like, what if he doesn't pick? If he doesn't pick your call and you call the time where you know he is online, he is not sleeping, then we have a problem. Stay on that alert mode. Keep controlling this guy to confirm if he is really single. So I'm going to category number two, whereby you have found the one already on online dating apps and maybe you have met already or not yet met, but this guy has shown you actions that he is the one. I did a video, I told you how to know if the guy is seriously looking for love on online dating apps and how to know if a guy is the one if you have not watched those videos yet you can go and watch them then you'll understand what i am talking about by saying you know you have found the one already on online dating apps so uh, this guy is the one and he has sent you gifts already because i know there are some ladies who have received already a valentine's gifts even before the time even last time there is a dm i shared on my instagram stories of a lady who received gifts one week before the valentine's day oh my god some men can be very very sweet so if you know you are in a healthy long relationship with a guy that you found on online dating apps my tip number one to make tomorrow the valentine's day very special the unforgettable one you know what <laughs> most men don't expect anything on a valentine's day because they know us women always expect something from them on a valentine's day <laughs> so if you do something unique something special he is really going to appreciate very very much so number one thing you can do you wake up very early in the morning tomorrow and write a very sweet romantic message tell this guy how much you care tell this guy how you are happy and you feel blessed to have him in your life tell this guy he means the world to you tell him words that will make him feel like oh wow <laughs> i love this woman <laughs> You know guys even men likes to hear good words sweet words likes to feel special so just write that message and he is really going to appreciate it will be the unforgettable valentine's day for him because maybe he has never received such kind of a message from any woman you are the first one and guys if you do that please don't forget to bring the feedback <laughs> here in the comment section below or you can just come on my my instagram okay <laughs> so guys tip number two on how to make your valentine's special with your long distance boyfriend that you found on online dating apps guys i've been telling you to build your relationship so when you're building your relationship 
you need to put some efforts you need to be clever you need to be excited because without that, oh my God, your relationship is going to faint. And we don't want that to happen. So what you need to do tomorrow on a Valentine's Day to make your man happy and feel special, take some cute, cute pictures of you and send them to him with a very beautiful message below. Tell him how much you love him, like I said in the first tip. Tell him how special he is. Also, tell him you took those photos just special for him. But attention, <laughs> don't send your nude photos. Please, please. I've been saying this, but very, very unfortunately, there are some ladies that still take their nude photos and send them to men they have met on online dating apps even this morning i really got angry on a lady she came to me telling me that bella i shared my nude photos with my online boyfriend but surprisingly right now he doesn't want to respond to me what should i do i feel very frustrated i'm so anxious i'm so depressed very very sad crying guys we have been talking about this no matter how much you love that guy that you found on online dating apps no matter the beautiful words that this guy has been telling you no matter he has been sending you money please don't lose your dignity please don't send your nude photos to him some of them will make you feel comfortable by sending you their nude photos so that you'll be like ah he sent me his let me send mine but that's a trap they're putting you in they play with your psychology so please never fall into such kind of a trap because this lady told me the guy sent his nude photos that's why she was comfortable to send her nude photos to him guys i'm going to repeat this if a man asks you for nude photos or online sex he will never be serious never take this from me from the experience that i have helping ladies that have been on online dating apps it always ends badly even last time i told you there was a lady who shared her nude photos she even recorded herself naked sent the videos to the guy and immediately after sending the videos the guy was like oh you are going to be very famous because <laughs> i'm going to sell your videos and your nude photos and i'm also going to tag your name the girl came to me crying telling me bella what should i do i gave her some advice to calm her down so dear ladies please yes tomorrow is valentine's but i am not here to tell you just to record yourself naked or take your nude photos and send them to him it will make him feel special on a valentine's day no and a guy who asks for nude photos on online dating apps you need to ask yourself this how many ladies he has been asking for their nude photos many so maybe it's a business to him be careful guys we don't know where these photos are going to end so my point here is if a man loves you he loves you for who you are the way you look without even seeing your nakedness this is the truth so you taking efforts putting on a very beautiful dress that snatches your body very well without showing too much <laughs> And if you're someone who likes makeup, you make up very well, you make your hair, then take beautiful photos, two or three photos, try to be funny in those photos, send some kisses to him <laughs> in those photos and accompany the photos with a very beautiful message. He is really going to appreciate very, very much. I hope this helps you. Tip number three. And again, guys, I repeat you are doing these things to a guy that you know you are in a healthy long distance relationship not a guy that is still giving you lots of questions <laughs> is he the one boo italians will say boo i don't know is he not the one boo i don't know <laughs> 
<laughs> will he come to visit me Boo! i don't know even when <laughs> you can't do all these romantic thing to a guy like that <laughs> you only do the first tip that i told you calling him so if this guy is the one you know he is the one you are sure due to his actions so today night or even tomorrow morning you can send your online boyfriend a message that you want to make a video call with him at night so that he knows and if you are in a healthy relationship he won't be like no i can't call you i am busy or blah 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 of course he will wait for your video call but don't tell him what will be in that video call <laughs> or what you're going to talk about so organize something like a romantic dinner date with your online boyfriend create a very romantic environment <laughs> dress up very nicely you know with a beautiful dress or a beautiful top that snatches you well <laughs> with a beautiful color that brightens you up you know what i'm talking about <laughs> if you like making up then you know make up your face look beautiful <laughs> buy a bottle of wine if you are a wine taker if not just buy a drink that you like to drink if you've got some money buy a very small cake if you don't have money to buy a very big cake you can just buy a cupcake like for us guys we always have a valentine's cake <laughs> that's a must and we started that even before we got married before we started living together yes so a cake can be a very good idea a very small cake because at the end of the day it's you only that is gonna eat that cake <laughs> But show that you prepared something special for the Valentine's Day. You spend your Valentine's Day with him. Talk, but overall, your talk should be a very romantic talk. Don't forget to tell this guy how much you care for him. Don't forget to tell this guy how you thank God every day to bring him in your life. He is the best thing ever. <laughs> <laughs> make him feel loved make him feel special something else i wanted to add on that if you have any talent like singing you can sing a song for him while talking to him on a video call it's gonna melt his heart i am very very sure if you have a talent of dancing girl i've been telling you use your cards very well then use that opportunity on that video call that you're gonna make tomorrow and dance for him he will enjoy very very much and he will never forget that day <laughs> way number five that you can make valentine's special for your online boyfriend you are in a long distance relationship there are some ladies who will say i don't have time to call him i am very very busy you can just record yourself a voice message and then send it to him a very sweet romantic voice message to tell him that you really care for him you love him so much and tell him happy valentine's my love <laughs> apart from recording a voice message you can record a video a short clip you looking beautiful put together looking so <laughs> and tell this guy sweet sweet words you love him how much you appreciate him being in your life or you can just remind him that first day when you started communicating you know how you felt take him back to the sweet memories he will really really love that but apart from the sweet memories you can also try to be funny in that video send him some kisses show this guy that you really care that's why you have put some efforts to record that short video clip just special for him <laughs> and by the way guys i am telling you do this on a valentine's day but you can just choose to do one of these things that i'm telling you in any day <laughs> but if you have never done that then tomorrow is just perfect <laughs> 
<laughs> to do it. It is really going to strengthen your relationship and something good might happen after you have done that. <laughs> so friends, this message goes to all my fellow black women that are in interracial relationships. Whether you are married already or you are in a long distance relationship. Tomorrow is Valentine's, yes, but don't be carried away by what you see on social media. Because some of you will receive, let's say, one rose flower or just a small gift, or you might not even receive any gift, but maybe your husband or a guy you are dating will send you a very beautiful message, or he will call you to tell you that I love you. Appreciate that. Don't go to social media and start comparing what you got <laughs> with the gifts other ladies that are in an interracial relationship got. My dear sister, you will be ruining your happiness. Appreciate everything. I've been telling you, even if something is very small, appreciate that. It means a lot. As long as it came from his heart, that's so, so important. Because guys, the truth is, we are not eco and we will never be eco. So please don't use tomorrow, <laughs> the Valentine's Day, to compare your relationship with other people's relationships. Like for example, for me, I've already got my Valentine's gift and I'm very, very happy with that Valentine's gift. Even if I didn't get anything, I was still going to be happy because I know that my husband loves me very, very much. So no matter what I see on social media tomorrow, <laughs> won't disturb me at all because I am at my happy place and I appreciate my husband's efforts. But if I start comparing the gift that my husband gave to me and compare to a lady who got a very expensive, luxurious car as a Valentine's gift and this lady is married to a white man or is dating a white man, oh my God, I'll be only ruining my happiness and my marriage yes guys so guys me talking about the gift i know some of you are like bella can we see your gift <laughs> okay i'm going to let you see it because there is a history behind it so here is my gift it's a necklace <laughs> do you see it i really really love it i saw it in the store long time ago <laughs> and i told my husband oh my god there's a necklace i saw it's so beautiful i love it oh really i said yes <laughs> so just yesterday he bought it for me <laughs> i was so so happy because oh my god i love it i really really love it it's so so beautiful so he bought it for me and told me it's my Valentine's gift. <laughs> what do you think, guys? With the top that I'm wearing, it will be difficult for me to, you know, tie it. You won't see it well, but you'll see this necklace <laughs> in most of my videos. Yeah, but it's beautiful. Really, really beautiful. So, yeah, this is my Valentine's gift. <laughs> So guys, to my beautiful ladies that are still single, you are on online dating apps still searching, tomorrow is Valentine's, you will not have a couple's photo, couple goals <laughs> to post on Instagram or a Valentine's getaway, <laughs> you won't have all that, do not worry, trust in God your time is coming you will do all that god knows how many valentines i stayed alone before i got married lots of god knows how many valentines i was crying due to heartbreaks from men lots of but all that has passed now i am married i'm gonna be enjoying my valentines with my husband i'm telling you all this to keep believing in god that no matter this valentine's you are going to be single but the next valentine's you will enjoy it with your husband and dear friends let's learn to take 
every situation into a positive way so you being single it shouldn't make you really feel so bad feel so unfortunate feel very depressed or frustrated and start being desperate wanting to enter into a relationship that will make you cry after use that opportunity of being single now to do things that you really enjoy to do so a day like tomorrow on valentine's you can do things that you enjoy to do like going for shopping now you're like bella we don't have money for shopping <laughs> yes i like shopping just go for a window shopping god knows how many window shopping have done <laughs> at the time when i was really really broke but because i love shopping i could just go to the store and spend like four hours just going around the mall entering every single shop <laughs> that i see i do window shopping so that when i get money i buy whatever i liked in one of the stores and it was like a therapy to me guys so you can do that too tomorrow on valentine's create your own world girl <laughs> if you like food if you are a foodie just like bella you can cook your favorite food a very delicious dinner date you know eat your food take a glass of wine or a glass of juice enjoy a movie and then whew, the day passes <laughs> if you're someone that likes to go out you're not someone who likes to chill at home you know maybe enjoy the movie you can decide to go out if it is to go clubbing <laughs> go clubbing girl if it is taking yourself for a dinner date you don't want to cook take yourself on a dinner date treat yourself enjoy life stop thinking of ladies that are married already that have found love already stop thinking of those tomorrow on valentine's because it's gonna make you unhappy so do everything that you like to do and your valentine's will be the unforgettable one so i know exist lots of ladies that are still online dating apps searching for love and on a day like tomorrow you don't have sisters you don't have anyone by your side and maybe you feel like talking to someone please check me on instagram at african bella let's talk i'm gonna be there for you so dear friends i really hope you enjoyed this video and you learned something if you did please give it a thumbs up share it with your friends family everyone that you think will enjoy this video and learn something please don't forget the feedback <laughs> I'll be waiting after implementing everything that I have said in this video. Watch my other videos too. They are super good. You've got a lot to learn from those videos. Don't forget to subscribe. If you have not subscribed, please join the family. Until next time, guys, I love you so much. You're always here in my heart. Ciao, ciao.